Okay, and now that is how you grasp someone's attention with an anime. Classroom of Elite has got my attention. In this episode of Rathor Rip, I want to dive into our main M male MC, which I, I forget his name, still grasping all the names, but I do remember our main female MC, and that is Horikita. We find out she's this cold person because she is someone who just... She thinks people are going to hold her back, and she's actually chasing her older brother, who's in Class A, and the student council president. So that, that's uh, that's big. And we see how her brother was even going to treat her. She, he was going to hit her in the, in the gut. And to see the main male character be a complete badass, I didn't see it coming. I did not see that coming. He's not Hiki. Hiki, Hiki would not be doing none of that. I don't think he'd do none of that badass you. What's he may? Who knows? He, Hiki might. I don't know, but they're going like... I was like, whoa, is this about to be a brawl? Like... I didn't, I didn't know the show was going to go that way. And to see that he most definitely intentionally got 50s on all his test scores and or entrance exams intentionally, you can tell. It was just coincidence? No. No, no, no. That was not just coincidence. And we see that Horikita even sees through that. He's amazing. Our main MC is amazing. You can tell that. But yet, what was his reason? Why did he do it? Did he want? Is he trying to find something out? Is, is he trying to... Maybe, I said he wasn't going to be like Hiki probably, but maybe he is trying to find the real thing. Maybe he is trying to find some people along the way to call friends. Who knows whether that's consciously, whether, whether that's subconsciously, or whether he's doing it unconsciously. I don't know. And even the student council president and or he, Horikita's brother says, you're a unique man. He knows it. He knows he is a unique person. So the thing that really made this episode interesting was that the, the S system, the point system, one student equals 100 points or, or one point per student, which is what they get during if they pass the entrance or not entrance, but an exam. They haven't gone. They haven't gave us more info on that. We still want to know if it's more about if it's more than exam, stuff like that. But I'm assuming it is exams. One point equals 100 points. So per class and you have to progress as a class yes certain people can get expelled one by one individually and you won't get expelled as a whole class if someone fails but the whole class gaining points is huge to make you go from class d to c to b then to a and that's a, now it makes us interest you know it's make, it makes this main cast interesting because you can tell their way of thinking so different someone two people who are, you know who understand each other is horikita and our main male mc sure like they understand, like, their ideology, how they view people, like, how they think of things. Sure. It makes sense, and they understand, like, they'd be great sociologists, sure. But one doesn't know how to treat people because they are afraid to be held back, which is Horikita. And so, and at the same time, she's someone who doesn't have morals. She's more like Hiki than our main male MC. He thinks like Hachiman. He thinks like 8-Man. He thinks like Hiki. But he, he has morals. He's ground. He's not someone who thinks people are going to hold him back. He's someone who would most definitely rather just do his own thing, but not be rude, not be, you know, morally just terrible to people. You know, he's someone who understands morals as to where Horikita doesn't. So I'd say Horikita may be more like Hachiman than even our main MC, who was just partially like. But the thing that really got me excited, which I don't think I touched on, um, is the fact that the you have to work together as a class. Like, you cannot go forward. One person doing good does not mean everyone's going to go. You know, there's only six seats in the car. And you got to fill up every one of them. I mean, you're, you're driving 15 hours and you're going to fall asleep at the wheel you can't just drive that alone you got just my hat here now <laughs> now one thing you know the best the, the best thing about that is that means the cast is going to have to come together at some point you're going to have contradicting personalities you're going to have drama filled moments you're going to have build-ups between characters who don't like each other then finally explode and it's going to cause you know friction within the group in and of itself we see that in the study groups horikita did not get along with others but our uh our ubs character can't remember her name you guys know what i'm talking about the one that everyone likes she was able to bring people together as to where Horikita is able to make them segregate, make them split up, make them not want to be a part of the study group anymore. So you're going to see this conflict and contradiction between these characters. I love that. I love where Classroom of Elite's going. And I'm expecting this to possibly be the best anime of summer. And I'm not talking about leftovers. I'm not, I don't want to, I mean, I think this is going to hang with the leftovers. That's how good it is. I think it's going to hang with My Hero Academia. I think it's going to hang with, um, uh, recreators, you know, it's gonna hang with Virgin Soul because if you have a show even 
reminiscing about snafu that's impressive in itself because that means the writing's great no the writing's amazing and that's something that's always going to be able to hang with any kind of show if you have great writing you know the plot just has to be decent if, if it's written good it's going to be good if you if you let us understand the characters give us an insight on the characters it's going to elevate the show and that's what snafu did and that is what this show is doing but as always guys you guys have been hexed sure to leave a like comment, subscribe follow me on twitter x25 and before anyone asks me in the comments go watch the show